is Thursday here in our remote Alaska village and I'm gonna take you guys along for our day. In the beginning of this clip you saw us going um, cutting wood which was a really fun experience. We did that a couple days ago. Um, I haven't been on like the frozen Lake Clark in a long time so it was really cool going, seeing, driving the machines. It was very fun. Yeah, the other day when we went, it was kind of crazy. I don't know if you saw it, it was on one of the last clips. Um, we were driving up and it was fine. There was a couple places, you know, the ice, it has pressure cracks. So sometimes it goes like that. And so driving there, it wasn't too bad. And it's been probably like 30, 40 degrees, so a little bit warmer. Um, when we were driving back though, the ice shifted a lot and there was a lot of cracks and there was one point where there was like a foot and a half, two feet of a crack that I had to like zoom over and I wish I had my GoPro attached to the front of my snow machine because that would have been an epic video, but I did scream. It was scary. This ice is still a couple feet thick no matter like, you know, what we were doing and the crack that I crossed over, it wasn't even like that big if you're going fast enough you're fine so very very thankful <laughs> wasn't too bad but I decided that I'm not gonna do that again I was actually scared to drive and my dad's like oh you'll be fine just follow me and yeah I don't think I'll do that again <laughs> but for today I'm not quite sure what's gonna happen I'll take you guys along I know I have to go clean one of our rentals we actually had a film film crew here um yesterday and the day before i'm filming some stuff whenever that comes out i'll show you guys nothing to do with me or like my family although my dad was filmed flying and stuff like that but yeah let's see what today holds i'm not quite sure have a full tour of this place um pick up this coffee mug put it in the sink full tour of this place on youtube and it's under like winter guest house so if you want to see what it looks like you're welcome to stay to go look at it there and then also at the same time um we use this building as overflow for the resort in the summer. wasn't on. So here we are two hours later and we're starting the wash for the first time today. Oh boy. Okay, we'll be back.
last night for dinner. Usually lunch is just a leftover meal, but I needed a little bit more pasta for Jared and I wanted more green beans for myself. So chicken is in the microwave, have everything ready for when husband gets home from cutting wood. So which I saw them just pop up and dump off some wood not too long ago. So hopefully he'll be here in the next 10 minutes. I'll drop the recipe down below for this, what I did. Um, it's a Tuscan chicken crock pot recipe, really good. Um, after reading some of the reviews, I did add a little bit more cream, a little bit more cheese. I added a can of pimento peppers. I added some cream cheese. What else? Oh, I didn't have any spinach, so I didn't add spinach. But those were the only adjustments I made. Oh, and I added red pepper flakes, which I think that along with the the pimento peppers added a really nice little kick to it. So it was a really good option.